Hello, this is Lucas Palmeira from Imaginando, and today we're doing the 100th episode of Sound Design Tutorials with TRC. So for today's episode, I've chose to do the song called Osev by Julio Bashmore, and we have a lead that has some noise on it and a bass that it's like two basses to do. So let's get started. And we start with a, with a DRC on a default patch. I'm going to open it again here like this. And for today's episode, as you can see, I'm using an Ableton push. OK, so we have here our default patch. And sorry, let's get started. Change the first oscillator to a sine wave like this and I drop raise the resolution the resonance to 148 just a bit like this okay now I got the first envelope generator raise the attack to 110 decay to 274 Sustain at zero. Release 322. Okay. On the master, we have master at maximum oscillator one at 818 and 19, sorry, 819. Pre gain at 908, 909, sorry, 908. Okay. And finally, we raise the ring modulator to 370. So it has a little bit of these high frequencies. Finally, okay, this sound is done. Finally, we go to the send, and I have here a ballad reverb, and put it to maximum. Okay, so now let's go to the noise. So here I have this noise. Load a default patch. Okay, it doesn't matter what we have on the oscillator because we're going to drop it to zero, master and pre gain at maximum, noise generator at maximum as well. And now 500 on the filter, drop to 318 the cutoff, no, 918 the cutoff, sorry. like this resonance to th um, resonance to 390 okay now attack at zero decay at 214 this on the first envelope generator this one modulates the amplitude sustain at zero Release at 298. Okay. Now we go to the second envelope generator, the one that modulates the cutoff filter, and we raise the attack to 058. Decay at 230. Okay, should be okay here. Sustain at 400, and release at 100. So. Here we have our noise, raise the reverb to maximum, and we have the sound, and if we mix both. Like this. Okay, so let's now do the bass. Okay and open another DRC on the default patch. Here I basically have just a high pass filter on 30 Hertz just to cut off some of the low rumble, so don't worry about the equalizer. And let's go to the bass. Okay, so first thing I'm going to do is uh, first oscillator, I'm going to change it to a square wave. 
change it from poly to mono. Okay. Now, uh, master maximum 800, oscillator 1 at maximum, cut off at zero. Okay. Now, on the first uh, envelope generator, the one that modulates the amplitude, we have a decay of 70, 711, 711, sustain at maximum, release at 322. Okay. Now, on the second envelope generator, we have attack at zero, decay at 495. Okay, sustain at 328. And release at 417. Okay. So, the first sound is done. So, what we have to do to make the second sound, the only thing that we have to change is we copy this DRC, we go to the second base, I'm going to delete this one so you can be sure, and now I paste this DRC, okay? So we have the same sound, right? But what I'm going to do now is go to the second envelope on the first envelope generator, and I'm going to change the decay to 495. Sustain to 328. And the release to 417. Now we go to the second envelope generator. Uh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, the, uh, I should have left the first. The first has to be the same, sorry. It's 711. Sustain at maximum and release at 322. What I have to change is the second envelope generator. And the only thing I have to change here is the release. Change it to 52. Okay. And this should be it. Okay. So I think everything is ready, so let's now listen to the melody that I've recorded before. Just bear with me a second while I get this ready. Okay, I think everything is ready now. So let's now listen to the melody that I've recorded before. And this was it guys. I hope you have enjoyed this tutorial. If you have enjoyed this tutorial, please give us a like or subscribe to our channel. It was nice doing this 100, this 100 episodes. I hope we can do 100 more. So we'll see you again next week. Goodbye guys.